So a uh, question was asked, how can we put multiple PDFs together into a single file? And sometimes that's valuable, uh, particularly if you want to be able to view it. And in the case of a booklet, you want to kind of scan through it or scroll through it so that you can see how you know it's going to flow visually. Um, in terms of sending it to the printer, they are probably going to want it in a single file for each page. So it's definitely uh, not necessary to put them all together into a single document to send to the printer. And multiple pages will grow file sizes. So just kind of be aware of that. But you certainly can put pages together. And so what you do is you start off with a single PDF and open it. So we're going to open Michelle's here, and we've got the cover, and so I'm using Preview because it's already loaded on Mac. Uh, if you have Acrobat Viewer, that's fine. If you have Acrobat Pro, which you have to pay for, uh, it will let you do even more things. But if you're using a Mac, you can use Preview, and if you're using a PC, you can use an Acrobat Reader, which is a free download. So what we want to do here, you know, you got all your controls up here, and so what we want to do is insert. And we're going to go page from file. And we can go to the desktop where we have some other pages here. And we'll go ahead and put page one in. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to put page zero, which is the back of the front cover. There we go. And so now, actually, it uh, must have selected two by accident. It brought both in, but they are in the right order, so that's fine. So now we've got them here. We can, you know, bring in another one. I think we've got Page four, maybe, on the desktop. One, two, three. No, it's just pages one, two, three, but we're missing that one. Okay, and we want to move this. So we're just going to drag it down. put it underneath so that we can see them all in the correct order here. Now of course you can go to any of these just by clicking on them just like um, in any other PDF but you can view them a couple of different ways too. So we can go over here and we can select continuous scroll single page or two pages. We can also do the same uh, selections over here depending on how we want to see it. So under here we can also do a slideshow which may be the easiest way. So now we can scroll back and forth between the pages cover, back of the front cover, facing page, back of that page and that simply allows us to be able to see you know in a single setting without having to open individual documents how these are going to flow once it's turned into the booklet.